Hey everybody, it's Nicky 97 and this is part 59 of Milwaukee on Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door. In this episode, Sapphire Star Go! There's the fifth star in its place. Why not something weird? I've had the absolute weirdest song stuck in my head recently. It is, and I'm not even lying here, the opening theme song to the Kirby anime in Japanese. Kind of weird. Anyway. Ooh, that seems like a nice place. And over there we'll find the Garnet Star. Or if you're a fan of the Boston Celtics, the Garnet Star. Anyway. So, we have our location on the map. Right, let's pop in on that professor fellow. Yar. <laughs> I like pirates. Great news, my friends. The next crystal star is in Poshly Hat. Oh, hey, I forgot. Great news, my friends. The next crystal star is in Poshly Hat. And I literally just got an email for my YouTube page saying, KitKat1919 just subscribed to me. Thank you! And I got a feeling I know exactly who that is. Wait a tick. Wait, hang on. Wait a tick. I've heard tell that only rich and famous people call that place home. Yes, 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 and I'm fairly sure that the, there's also a shrine to the stars called the Poshly Sanctum. No fear, fearsome monsters or dangerous dungeons either. It's just a tourist attraction. <clears throat> Sounds positively hmm. Sounds positively scintillating, dear boy. Point us there. That's the best part. That's the best part. You ride the most famous train of all, the XS Express. Train, you say? Yes. After a luxurious steam engine ex excursion, the next crystal star will be yours. Okay, I don't think there's ever been a sentence that had that many X's in the same sentence that didn't involve Ford. <laughs> Getting those crystal stars has been back-breaking work, but this time it'll be a cinch. Pardon me for saying so, but mustn't you be... But mustn't you have wealth or fame to ride that train? Hmm. That may be true. Perhaps you should ask Don Pianta for... To help you with this. No, 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 no. I do not ask the Mafia for two favors. That is a good way to end up with a horse head in your bed. Seriously, I've watched The Godfather. I know how this shit rolls. Ah, no, terribly sorry. Impossible. Can't do it. The man's reprehensible. Well, drat. I suppose there's nothing for it, eh, boy? If we must, we must. Let's go. Excellent. Then we're set. We may not have much time, so you must hurry. I'll gather all the information I can. You guys should handle your end of things. Alright, but first, uh, we got the piece of paper on Cortez. Uh, stuff on Lord Crump. And, uh, that's it. Okay, now there's one more thing that I want to do before we start uh, getting ready to head for the Excess Express, which is, ironic, which is, oddly enough, my second favorite chapter in this entire game, right behind uh, Glitzville. I don't know why, I just like the Excess Express, it's kind of a fun one. Hey, Han, is there anything new for you? Uh, oh yeah, we got some new stuff. Double pain, double the damage mark. Why would anybody get that? Unless, like, I guess maybe if you were doing a hard run of this game, but seriously, there's got to be more effective ways of doing it than that. Anyway, <clears throat> excuse me. Let's go down here. I think this is where we need to go. Uh, doo -doo -doo. yeah, I think it's right through here, maybe. Shoot, I should be able to remember where this is. Whoa, Hammer Bro! 
Dude, I was in the air. Literally. Like, you did not just hit me just now. Oh, and by the way, uh, now that we have the Spike Shield badge equipped, we can do that. And, uh, might as well show off Bobber's two new moves. Um, the first one is called Hold Fast, which will damage enemies that directly attack Bobbery. Uh, I guess it's kind of like a recoil thing. And then there's Babamast, which will uh, attack all enemies with a massive blast. And I have just, I have, it takes nine flower points to do this one, so use it only when you're running out of options. But look at that! It did eight damage to a non-defensed foe. That is impressive, okay? But anyway, uh... Oh, I think it's... Oh, there. Crud. Move, Hammer Bro. Uh, just wondering, would a female Hammer Bro be called a Hammer Sis? Just something to think about. Anyway, let's try this again. Go down the sewer thing. Great. Uh, get out... You, er, crush. Go down the hole. Yoshi, go down the hole. Oh, wait, no, that wasn't it either. Damn it. What do I do? Oh, you're back. Oh, by the way, I don't know if I mentioned, but there's, there was a uh, star piece back here, but I accidentally already picked it up, so... Come on, go down! Why can't I remember where I'm supposed to be? Okay, well, this is the right way. Sweet. So, uh, what you're going to want to do is go through here. I can squeeze through there. Whoa! That was close. And now that we have the ship panel, we can ride along here and find out where this goes. And I think it goes back all the way through... All of the pipes and the other side of this, so yeah, it's kind of a long ride. La -dee -da -dee -da. Okay, this is getting boring. Are we there yet? Thankfully, yes, we are, because it is right over here where we need to be going through this last door. Look at that. Three freaking uh shine sprites lots of spanias for experience and a pink spania for some reason and a badge up there which we will be getting every single one of those uh i'm gonna cut for just a second so that i can take out all these guys so i'll see you guys in a second okay i just fought what had to be 20 of those things you know how many experience or how many star points I got out of all that? Freaking five! <sighs> anyway, you can't get this other shine sprite until you get another power-up, which we'll probably be getting in this next chapter. But anyway, since we haven't shown this guy yet, or what this guy does yet, or the difference between an orange and a pink Spania, come on. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. So let's see what th this thing is. Okay, so apparently it's something. It's a Spoonia. Okay. It has defense. Fantastic. I'm just gonna go ahead and bomb squat it to death. And I figured out what the sweating thing is. Whoa, that's impressive. Oh dear. Well, I'm asleep. That's great. Oh, well, that woke me up. Nice try. Ha ha ha. But yeah, the sweat means that they're about to get attacked by the bob or bomb squad. But, uh, let's see here. Restores Mario and his allies a few... 
Uh, it does the same thing as Sweet Treat, but only better. Uh, let's try Art Attack on these guys, for, just so I can get rid of all of them. Probably didn't need to use Bomb Squad. But... Since it's just this one now, I can focus on getting him. Wow, that was easy. And look at that, 15 star points for that one guy. Or for the Spoonia. Okay, so let's get uh, Crush out real quickly. Crud. I did that wrong. I got a feeling that this one's going to take me a little while to get the timing down on. Come on. Oh, maybe not. As far as we can end. Got it. The Defend Plus badge. All that for a badge I'm probably not going to use. Fantastic. Well, I would use it, but the BP for it is probably massive. Let, let, me, let me just see here. Yeah, five uh, badge points for the Defend Plus. I, I mean, that might be useful, but I already have plans for a lot of my BP, and I'm about to meet, reach my max for BP, actually. So, I, I think that the max amount of BP that you can have is uh, 30. Could be wrong on that. Uh, I'll have to look it up. But, uh, yeah. Now we are, uh, now that we've done that, we can, uh, go ahead and, I guess, we have to talk to the Don. As long as we don't have to run into that magical, but first, there we go. Uh, okay. Hang on a second. <coughs> sick. And it's a little bit ironic that I'm sick right now because... Hang on. You! I ran into a bunch of you guys over at uh, that uh, other place. Just The place where Cortez was. Anyway, actually there's a crack in the wall right there. And you can get a shine. So that's cool. Whoa! And a star piece. I almost missed that. So I'm pretty sure that we can just go straight through. Yep. Alright, that's cool. So, now that we've done that. Yeah, that's what I was talking about before. Let's see, is there anything back here? No, okay. Let's talk to him. Jessica. Oh, poor boss. The big man's been sick with the loneliness ever since his daughter skedaddled. Our underboss Frankie's gone, the boss is in shambles, what's the syndicate to do? This scruffy gang of punk thieves is stealing jobs from us left, right and left. Hey, but enough about us and our stupid problems, what can we do for these? Well, tickets for the ritziest train around, for the Access Express. Oh, you want tickets for that rolling winding? Uh, yeah, kinda. Ooh, ain't nothing we can do about that. What? You're the Mafia! You can do anything! Yeah, it's giving out tickets. That's rich. You gotta talk to the boss for that. Well, he's kind of incapacitated right now, so what's the dealio? Where's Jessica? Can't stand to see the boss like this. I can't stand to see Fox like this! Oh, dear God, did I just re Did I just compare the Mafia to freaking Slippy? We just knew where the, those newlyweds was. We could take the boss to see him. Hang on, those two front, 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 friendly? Those two friendly folk, Frances, Frankie and Francesca from Key Hall Key. Well, oh, that's a tongue twister. Who's on the what now? What'd you just say? Repeat that. You know where the young Miss Piata's at? Uh, yeah, kind of. Really? No lie. I swear to you, if you lie, I'll turn you into a confetti, so help me. Paper joke for the win again! Yeah, this seems like a rocky okay. Well, that's where she is. Why don't you bring it back here? Huh? Be a pal. We go do it ourselves, but we can't leave the boss unprotected, you get me? 
Yeah, you, know, you bring us the young Miss Francesca, and we do what we can to get you train tickets. You got a deal or what? Alright, that sounds fine. See, now that's better. I knew once you'd understand our predicament and you could refuse. Don't screw this up. Yes, we have been made an offer that we cannot refuse and all that good jazz. But, uh, in the next... We're going to tackle all that in the next episode. Uh, so, this has been Nikki D 7 and I'm going to buy a life shroom. <laughs> oh, we shaved down some set points. And we have a super shroom. Cool. Oh, yeah, they just put it right there. Sweet. Uh, so anyway, uh, yeah, I think that's just about it. And let me see something real quickly. Is there anything behind this pipe right here? Yes, a star piece. I thought I saw that whenever I was passing through. Uh, so, well, actually, before we do, I know I keep stalling, but I got in a few st shine sprites recently. So, I'm going to head back to Merlin to get one more of my party members upgraded. And that party member is going to be Crush. And I'll tell you why. His final move, Stampede, is actually really freaking handy. And it's more powerful than Koops' attack all ground enemies move. So, uh, yeah. And by the way, once you level up somebody twice, you can't level them up anymore. They can, they can all only go up twice. So, there's that. But, uh, yeah. Once we get done with this, then we will be done. Is, and is Crush flipping me off? What the... <laughs> okay, so yeah, he'll get Stampede, and I'll show that off uh, probably in the next video. So, yeah, this has been NikkiV917. Thanks for watching. And in the next episode, part 60, we're going to be headed for Key Hall Key to go find Frankie and Francesca. So, uh, I'll see you guys then. Later.